Joining us now is Bill Roden, a columnist for ESPN and Scape. Good morning to you, Mr. Roden. Good to see you. So we just see the suspension has changed from six now to eleven, five million dollars. Is that enough? No, no, no. And in fact, uh, at first I was thinking, uh, you know, I would have done fifteen. How then many, after how many, I, how many games are in a season? The seventeen. Well, why I wouldn't you just do the whole? Well, season? well, then, and after I heard this this nonsense, his mm -hmm. apology, I would have shut him down for the season because mm -hmm. clearly he does not get it. Mm -hmm. He doesn't get it. Uh, the Browns don't get it. This whole thing is about the highest value and all this being about money. Mm -hmm. But really, listening to, to Watson, I'm thinking this guy clearly does not get it. He said, I'm standing on my innocence. Mm -hmm. said, you, you, you've got to be totally in denial. Yeah. And they're talking about therapy. And I, I think that he's probably, I could see him sitting in a therapy session and said, I don't have a problem. You got the problem. Yeah, I think about the women, Bill, whose lives are forever changed. And if that was his idea of apology... He needs a lesson or two. You know, there just seems to be no contrition. But on the other hand, he's saying, I didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, and, 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 and some people say, well, do you really believe that? I think he believes that. I think he's in total denial. And then you hear the owner, one of the owners, D. Haslam, talking about this will be a, a good opportunity for talk about sex trafficking. This isn't about sex trafficking. This is about your player, the person you, you, you gave a boatload of money to, despite stuff you knew was coming down. This has nothing to do with with sex trafficking and putting the burden on women. And that, that is a whole moral morass. So this isn't a great day for the NFL at all. So, Bill, the Atlanta Falcons wide receiver Calvin Ridley was suspended for the entire 2022 season yeah. for betting on games. He admitted to gambling on football games. How do you square that with what we're seeing from John Watson? You don't. You, you don't. That's women. Yeah, no, you, you don't. You know, but again, when you're talking about a, a league whose highest value is money, they're saying this guy is you're screwing with our money. So we're going to shut him down for a year. So where does that, that leaves you no wiggle room when you come into a thing like, like, like Watson. The only thing you could have done is shut him down for the season. Yeah, but you said not a great day for the NFL. But listen, Roger Goodell did say, clearly he wasn't happy with the six game. Yeah. Because they could have left it alone. He said, no, 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 let's oh, yeah. let's go back yeah. and revisit that. And the arbiter had yeah. said that the behavior was egregious and predatory. And, yeah. uh, predatory, and, and Goodell agreed. He, he did up things. Is $5 million not a lot of money for Deshaun Watson? Well, yeah, I, no. mean, I think you made the it's point. It's, it's, isn't his contract $230 million? Yeah, I mean, it's a lot of money. You know, I mean, $5 million is a lot of money. But $5 million. I at, <laughs> yeah. Let's not be cavalier. I'm not poo-pooing $5 million. Yeah. But how do you put, but I think what we're talking about here is, is how do you put a value on women's lives? I mean, this, this boils down to you to yep. believe women or you don't. I believe women. Yes. You yes. know, a period. So, no, so $5 million, what, what's the value here? I'm just saying that the thing that's bothering me is that Deshaun does not think that he did anything wrong. And clearly, he did. He's got an issue. He's got, he's got a problem. Yeah. And I think the NFL has, has come a long way. Uh, you know, they have come a long way. But uh, I just think there's a moral morass in Lake Erie with the Browns. Wow. Yeah, I think so. when you have more than dozens of women speaking up, you need to pay attention. It'll be very interesting yeah. to see what the fan reception is there yes. uh, week 15. Yeah. Uh, Bill Roden, thank you very much. Appreciate yeah. it.